Hi, Super Spruce here, back with another incremental Googology video, episode 9. And you can see I have grinded just far enough to get a new base number. 0, 1 of 3. This is gonna reset all of this stuff, but keep the fast growing hierarchy prestige. And yeah, it's. I'm gonna unlock base 4. So basically, I think this is just gonna work exactly the same way as base 3 did and it's gonna I could try to go for some achievements such as I don't know two is less than three is that even possible with base four um it could be possible because I don't need to worry about base four at all and I could get as many base threes as I can and you can see I can I can get up to e1 106 even a little higher but even with that Oh, I'm, I'm so close. I need E129 to get there. Actually, what I could do, since this doesn't raise the multiplier, is I can do one of these, and maybe now I have two is less than three. I hope, at least, because this is E13, this is E14. So, let's see. Yes, I do have this. So, that means I've achieved only two cells. I was hoping that the cells were going to, like, gonna, were going to, like, stack in that this would be four cells because I have this cell, this cell, this cell, and this cell. But that's okay. I'm now boosting zero only Bashigu matrix matrices by 64 times. And again, the last row is impossible because it's commented out in the code. Um, there's this, which is impossible, and this, which is also impossible, or at least I think. And I don't really want to try going for it. Because you can see, it's just not a multiple of the other. Like 2.45 E14, 3.38 E14. Yeah, that's not happening. So now I'm gonna what happens if I manually max everything out? So I can I can do I can do some base four unlocks, which basically are the third prestige layer, because this is the omega prestige layer, this is the omega plus one prestige layer. So now I start doing base three unlocks until I can get another base four unlock. And you can see um I think I need to, yeah, I need to get four of these to do an unlock. So that, that means it is going to take a while. I can start doing base two unlocks and, whoa, E2000, just out of nowhere. Or not, not out of nowhere, but yeah, I can see how powerful all these unlocks really are. So it's like E480, this is after one base three unlock, E540, another base three unlock, E590, E640, E700, E770, now base 2 unlock, E900, E1100, E1300, I can do a base 3 unlock, so it's going to take me back down to E900 until I get back up to E1400, um, one more unlock, I'm up to E1700, another unlock, and I'm up to E1960, I still probably have meant a lot to go, yeah, I have 13 of these. One more unlock, E2200, and now I can do a base 4 unlock. So, yeah, a lot a lot of resetting involved. I'm just going to do as many base 3 unlocks here. And then E900, E1100, E1300, E1600, E1800, E2200. I can do a base 3 unlock, so I have to reset. I don't know how much I need for the next base 3 unlock. It's E2400, which is definitely possible right there. And then keep doing this, E1600, E1900, E2300, E2700. I'm going to need like E4000 for the next one of these though. Um, I, can, I can keep doing more, E2800, E3200. I, I may actually get to E4000 here, E3800, and then E4300, E4400. This is crazy. Base 4 is so powerful. It's... I mean, I know this. This is E one hundred fifty seven thousand, which may seem like a lot, but I'm, I am gain. My exponent has literally quintupled. Like at this rate, it's not going to be that bad to reach. Like I don't even know how far I can go here. So I'm just going to keep doing this until I can get more unlocks here. E thirty two hundred. What do I need for the next one? E forty eight eighty five. That's probably possible, which is crazy. I don't, and these unlocks are basically indefinite. I I don't even know how many this is. 1, 3, 5, 6, 8, 
10, 12, 12th dimension, basically. And I can, yes, I can do another one of these unlocks, phase three unlocks. So holding down a zero key. Now, if I just do as many as I can, E5400, E6300, that looks like the most I can do. E6400, I should probably also enable this to keep this going because I did disable this. So yeah, I can get almost 14,000 fast growing hierarchy number. The next unlock is at E7, 7300 or E9700 or E8600. And I think this is now the 13th dimension. Plus I have two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven 11 dimensional growth here. And then ninth dimensional growth here. So that is, that means the polynomial growth is now X to the 33rd power. It's crazy. And it looks like this is still not the fastest way, at least as of this run, to get fast growing hierarchy number. But this is so much fast growing hierarchy number, like 15,000, that I'm going to be able to get a lot of stuff. Like, even disregarding these items, I could get something like fast growing hierarchy number grows passively by one tenth of your best fast growing hierarchy number per second. So now I don't even need that much. And it looks like there is a. I don't even know what this This is like the base three. I'm first going to buy the third dimension of this. And then I can get. Basically, I, I don't even know what this is. It's probably like the third base of that. So now it's going to be so powerful. I can even I can even afford one more of these as well. And I don't think there's anything that's based on unspent fast growing hierarchy number at this point. So I can just spend away. So now all I need to do, basically, I can just if I just do some two unlocks, I don't even I don't even need base three. I guess. I think two base two unlocks is enough to get a fast growing hierarchy number. Now I'm not sure if this is really the fastest way to get fast growing hierarchy priest. I feel like it is. Let's see if this went from this is still 13 times, so I don't think it's really based on that. However, this is going up a lot faster now, so I can afford one more of these. The next one of these is 896. So that's gonna that may take a while. But I think the fastest way to get fast growing hierarchy number is now to start. Um, I should probably enable this. I I guess I could do priority up. Doesn't really matter. And just do base three unlocks and base two unlocks so I can easily get to base four. Base four does still take a while though. So maybe maybe if I want to go the fastest I can, I can just do a few base three unlocks. It gives me five fast growing hierarchy number or six in not too long it still says the peak was at one so I, doing doing some doing some of these i can get three pretty quickly but base four still is a challenge to reach and speaking of challenges maybe i should do some of them i'm not quite sure if i should do them right now now i'm thinking about it i think that these like quality things are going to be impossible like I don't know how I'm, I'm supposed to do this at all. So I'm just going to get zero loom and all loom. I can discard it if I want, which does spend this. So I'm, I'm, I might want to be careful with that. Um, but basically, this is just going to allow me to get faster, faster growing hierarchy number. I should have done this a lot earlier, but um, yeah, the achievements keep like eluding me. So you can see, yeah, it's very quick now. Now I'm getting, I don't know. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of fast growing hierarchy number per second. At least enough. Well, then it starts slowing down. I don't know what. This this game, probably, this game has a lot of bugs, unfortunately. But maybe it's I'm ready to start um, these challenges. Oh, God. Yeah, turn off my automatons. Disable all. Oh my god, E negative 106. That has to be a record. Um this this has to be possible now, right? I hope if I get this, I might just be able to flat out reach the challenge goal. Yeah, right there. Boom. Challenge complete. That means I get automatic zero only Bashiku matrix unlock. Which means that, that which means I can automate my runs a lot better. 
Let's see if I can get any other challenges complete. Challenge four. Um, this this one was really, really, really hard before. I don't know if I can do it now. Like, but maybe I can do it. Yeah, this just. Whoa. Yeah. Well, at least at least I can unlock. I can unlock. I can also get a new base number. Oh my god. E divided by E fifteen thousand. Oh god. Oh, maybe I can do it? Oh, come on. Okay, at least I can unlock. Okay, just wait a little bit longer for this. <laughs> yeah, this is this is a bit of a rough one. Get this. Um, get the highest thing I can purchase, which is probably this. Then this. Yeah, there we go. Challenge complete. Boom. This gives me... Automatic fast growing hierarchy prestige, and it doesn't really say anything other than automatic fast growing hierarchy prestige. I can't really customize it at all. This still could be good if I'm trying to, let's say, um, like, let's say I want to do this and this and this. And this will give me very quick fast growing hierarchy prestiges that have that weren't be what well, that weren't able to be automated before so that that's pretty cool and it's probably still the best way to get fast growing hierarchy number considering i haven't really gotten any more boosts and it looks like it unlocks some more stuff here um fast growing hierarchy challenge two and three together and um challenge three and four together yay it basically it un Enables threshold of automatic zero only bash you matrix unlock. Now I could try that. Yeah, why not? Well, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna try this because challenge two wasn't too bad, or at least challenge three definitely isn't too bad. And challenge two, at least if I wait for the multipliers, I think it's fine because once once this goes back up to an exponent of one, I was ba basically able to just brute force the challenge. So that's what I'll do. It's basically it's like I, I I forgot what it's even based on, but um it seems like it's just divided by one. So there we go, challenge complete. Um it basically says unlock this at most x, y, and z times. So that might be useful. It's not the most useful thing ever, but it's okay. This seems a lot more useful. Reach E100 to enable threshold of automatic fast growing hierarchy prestige. This is going to be a lot harder, though. I'm not sure if I want to go for, for this immediately. And instead, I might want to go for some challenges that actually boost something. So, this is the weird eagerly buy max thing that I'm still unable to get more than four, which is weird. I don't know how I'm ever going to complete this challenge if I can't actually get more than four number. I mean, this is getting closer to E100, but I, don't, I just don't know what to do. And also, this reward is worded so weirdly. Then you start with only two Bashiku matrices available for every base number. As if, you know, that's a good thing, almost. Even though this starts with every four available. So the reward isn't even good. It's just a, it's like a negative reward. I don't understand this. Maybe I'll do six instead. Spend the end to buy... Yeah, it's, it's basically the challenge whatever I, the the challenge six no challenge 12 no no the challenge six it's it's like antimatter dimensions challenge six so i'm pretty sure i can just afford to just buy max of all this and while this isn't the most promising thing ever well this is definitely not the most promising thing ever i'm up to e73 which isn't bad but i need to get to e100 and that means if I do, that means this challenge might be possible, but if it is, it's going to take a long time to complete. This is something where I can definitely enable an automaton because there's no bad or no risk in getting this. And then we can take a look at the other challenges to see if they're at all possible. So, seven is, um, the more ZM you have, the weaker they are. So, I think this challenge is possible, though, because 
basically it's just going to be these infinity dimensions, yes I'm calling them that, that are going to, or the fast growing hierarchy items, that's what they really are. They're just going to enable the victory, and I'm getting enough passive fast growing hierarchy number that if I just wait a little bit, I'll be at like thousands or even tens of thousands, and I'll be able to get several of these, which will all boost a whole bunch of stuff. So that's what I'm going to do. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out.